Hey everybody, this is Jason Parker from jasonparkerspeaks.com and today I want to talk to you about, uh, about why I'm wearing such a funny hat. <laughs> but seriously though, actually the reason I have such a funny hat on is because obviously it is quite chilly at the moment. Is uh, You can see how snowy it is. It's, uh, it's very, very cold and, and wintry but, but you know, I'm still doing one of the favorite things that, that I love to do and that's, uh, you know, spend time with, uh, with my dog out walking. But seriously, what I wanted to do, I wanted to talk to you still about hats. But what I mean by that is the different hats that we're forced to wear on a daily basis. Uh, because obviously, all of us, uh, we have a lot of different hats that we wear. You know, be it employee or business owner, uh, spouse, parents, uh, child, um, any number of different things and and so we're forced into all these different hats on a regular on a daily basis and and so there's three things that I just wanted to touch base on really quick um, that things that I've learned that have helped me be able to maintain some balance with regarding wearing all these hats and so the three things are first is you can only wear one hat at a time second you want to really schedule time to wear those individual hats and third when you do schedule that time you really, really want to focus on being present and being there totally. So let's talk about these just a little bit more detail. So the first one is you can only wear one hat at a time. You see, yeah, you know, it is pretty cold out here, but I'm only wearing one hat. And the reason is that, you know, when you start putting more hats on, it starts getting uncomfortable. And, you know, that's the way it is when we start trying to do too many, wear too many hats in real life on a regular basis too, is that we end up uncomfortable, sometimes overwhelmed, um, just, you know, sometimes stressed out, having to do a lot of things that, that at the same time, when we'd be a lot more productive if we actually took a little bit of time and just wore the one, the one hat, which leads us into step number, or the second point that I want to talk about is scheduling time to wear these individual hats. So, and this is something that quite often when we try to wear all these different hats at once, all so many different things end up like I said before, I, we end up being very unproductive. And so, like if you think about it, it's, it's so much better to schedule some specific time to wear some of these different hats. So it's like, if, you're, if you gotta wear the parent hat, schedule that time so you can have that time with your kids. And try and block everything else out. You know, if it's, if it's uh, the hat that you need to wear is that of employee, make sure that when you're at work, that that's what you're doing, you're at work, and obviously that time is kind of blocked off for you already, unless you're self-employed, and so you got to really make sure that you do take some time to block off for, uh, to, to build your business. And so these, this actually goes naturally into the, the third thing that I, I talked about, is making sure that you're fully present. When you do wear that hat, be there 100%, because otherwise you're going to miss out on a lot of different things. And you're just not going to be as productive, like I said before. So it all comes down to productivity. So again, in, in summary, um, yeah, I got a funny hat on today, but it serves good purpose uh, because there was the three things. Just a, a quick quick review is uh, the first thing, you can, you can only wear one hat at a time. Second thing, schedule time to wear those hats. And third, when you are wearing that hat, be totally present with it and take advantage of that time. So... This is Jason Parker from jasonparkerspeaks.com. Uh, I'd love to actually hear kind of some of the different hats that you wear and how, how the, the different roles, how that plays out in your life. So if you want to go, go to my website, jasonparkerspeaks.com slash blog and post some comments below this, I'd love to be able to get some feedback. So with that, uh, I wish you all the best in happiness, health, and wealth. And uh, I hope where you are, it's a little warmer than where I am because it is pretty cool here, but... Uh, but it sure is beautiful. So I'll just give you a little panoramic shot here quick. So have yourself an absolutely fantastic day.